Today I'll be seeing who makes the best ice cream sandwich. YouTube, welcome to the channel. My name is Jason. Here on this channel, I do food and product reviews. Like I said today, I am comparing five different ice cream sandwiches from different companies to see who makes the best one. I have ice cream sandwiches from Great Value, Blue Bunny, Dean's Favorite Day, which is Target's newest brand, and Klondike. So let's start off with uh, Great Value and start comparing these. Okay, the Great Value ice cream sandwich, 150 calories, 12 come in the box, and it's 256 for that. Looks like a normal ice cream sandwich. Ice cream sandwiches are my go-to ice cream treat. It's one of my favorites, so this one's gonna be exciting. I have nothing to compare it to, so, but I can tell right now, the cookie itself, the wafer, decent. The ice cream inside, not so good. You can tell that's Walmart's just plain vanilla ice cream. It does, it's not a good vanilla ice cream. Mm. And if I'm gonna, I'm gonna give these, to give them a little more room, one to 100 on these. Um, not great. It's kind of hard to screw up an ice cream sandwich, but that ice cream inside this isn't very good. I'm gonna go 42 on this. Okay, next up we have Blue Bunny. Again, 150 calories for this. This one only came with nine in the box and 489. So a lot more expensive for these. So I'm hoping or expecting the taste of these to be a lot better. It's definitely a different, a shorter, fatter, almost thicker ice cream sandwich. Look how white that ice cream is. Hoping this is some good Blue Bunny vanilla ice cream in here. It's a thick daddy. Mm hmm Already right off the bat, ice cream, way better. But the problem is, it's almost too thick. I'm almost getting the ratio of ice cream to the wafer. A little too much ice cream. Yeah, it's decent, but again, the reason ice cream sandwiches are shaped the way they are, it's like the perfect ratio. When you're doing this and you're making it fatter and shorter like that, and you're giving yourself more ice cream, I don't know. To me, it doesn't work. I don't like it as much, but I do like it better than that great value. I'm gonna go 66 on this one. It's decent, but I think there's better out there. Okay, next up we have Dean's ice cream sandwich. Again, 150 calories. This one came in 10 in the box and 348 for these. So a little cheaper than the um, Blue Bunnies. Back to the normal shape of a ice cream sandwich. Um, typically, like I said, I am an ice cream sandwich fan. It's what I usually get. Um, I typically go with Purple Cow. I didn't do Purple Cow in this taste test. Purple Cow is Meyer their store brand. The reason I didn't do it is because Meyer's pretty much just a Midwest store where these, I believe, are sold at stores across nationwide. So that's why I went with that instead of doing a localized one. Um, the Purple Cow, they're okay. They're not great. I get them because they're cheap. They're definitely better than the Great Value ones. Okay, back to the review. Dean's Ice Cream Sandwich. Solid. The ice cream. And what do we call this? The cookie? The cookie, the sandwich part, the wafer. I'll call it the cookie. The cookie portion versus the ice cream. You can see it's pretty thin, so not near as much ice cream as that Blue Bunny one. But this is working. I'm liking this one. I still feel... It's probably better, but yeah, that's pretty good. I'm going to go 74, 74 on this one. Okay, next up is Target's brand, Favorite Day, their new brand. Um, they had Market Pantry, and I don't know what's going on with that. If Market Pantry is done, they're not using that anymore, or if it's, and it's all going to be Favorite Day. If you know more information, Leave it in the comments below.
because there was nothing in the freezer section saying market pantry anymore. And from what I read, there's gonna be lots of new products under the favorite day labeling. So if you know more information on it, throw it in the comments below. So like I said, favorite day ice cream sandwich. This one is 150 calories again, 12 in the box, 229. So the cheapest of all of them, is it gonna taste the cheapest? We'll see. Looks very similar to the Walmart one and the Dean's. The cookie portion, a little harder. That ice cream, I can already tell, is better than Walmart's. It's starting to get soft. In this one, compared to, like the Blue Bunny, I said, the ice cream overpowered the sandwich. This one, the cookie is. Um, it's a little thicker, a little tougher. It's not bad for the price. These act pretty good. It's getting soft pretty quick, which I took all these out at the same time. This one's getting the softest, the quickest. I say maybe the least amount of ice cream. It's hard to tell because it's all squishing out the sides. The ice cream is better than Walmart's. Um, but other than that, I'm not liking too much what's going on here. I'm gonna go, hmm. I mean, it's solid. But it's not great. 62. I mean, I've been scoring them kind of low, leaving room. I mean, I thought some of these would start to blow me away, but they're not. All right, lastly, I have the Klondike ice cream sandwich. This one, unlike all the others, were 150 calories. This one's 180, so an extra 30 calories. Only six in a box, 374. So for the amount you're getting, these are the most expensive. And um, I was recommended to do this review by one of you, and they said the Klondike one was their favorite. So I've never had this. We'll see. Is it going to be my favorite? It's not going to be too hard because these scores are pretty low. So I can already see it's starting to melt a little there, but we'll see how this is. First off, shaped like the Blue Bunny, but not as thick. But something like this is the first one where I bit into it, and it's such a different taste than all the other ones. Is it the ice cream? I'm picking at it. I'm dissecting it because it, for the price of it, I feel like I should really like this. But I'm not, I'm not liking it at all. With that ice cream, I don't know. I'm not liking it. I'm not liking the taste of that ice cream. I do like it better than Great Value. But what did I put Great Value at? What was that, a 42? I'm sorry, especially for the one who recommended this and said this is your favorite. I don't know. I, I, leave it in your comments below. Have you tried this? Klondike ice cream sandwich. What do you think of it? Maybe I'm in the minority of not liking this, but I'm gonna go 49. Sorry, Klondike, but yeah, I, I don't care for that one. Like the ice cream is weird. The cookie portion of it doesn't have a lot of flavor to me. Like it's not standing out as much as some of those other ones. Um, so yeah, 49. Looking at these scores, I mean, great value, I gave a 42. Blue Bunny, 66. Dean's, 74. 62 for favorite day, and then Klondike, 49. Uh, maybe I do need to bring in Purple Cow and compare that to Dean's. I mean, since Dean won, is there any other, and Aunt Millie's? Is it Aunt Millie's? So I know there is a few more out there. And I saw these at Target and I didn't get them just because I was like, well, I already have five. Um, Annie's Organic Vanilla Mini Ice Cream Sandwiches. So there's still that brand. Um, Purple Cow and compare those to Dean's. Is there any others out there that I've missed that maybe I should review and do a follow-up? If you want to see a follow-up, uh, bringing in some more and have them go head-to-head -head with Dean's, 
since Dean's ones this won this round, um, get those other ones because I just feel like there should be some better ice cream sandwiches. And there are the Disney ones. Um, I'm just trying to think if they're. I know there's the the. I don't know if they have cookies and cream ice cream or if they just have vanilla. If they have the Mickey one with just vanilla ice cream in it, I'll grab that one too. You know, if you're interested, leave it in the comments below if you want to see another round, bring in some other brands, because I just, I don't know. I feel like we're missing something here. I was expecting to be really blown away by it because since I like ice cream sandwiches and these just didn't do a whole lot for me. So maybe we'll get some other ones in here, try it out and see which one is the actual best because I just feel like there should be better than Dean's. Like I wasn't super thrilled with Dean's, but it won this round. So there you go. If you've enjoyed this video, smash that like button, subscribe to have nerds subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.